Okay, so the very first time that you go in, they tell you your, diag your diagnosis is a contusion. A contusion is a bruise. Okay, so the very first time that you go in, they tell you your, diag your diagnosis is a contusion. A contusion is a bruise. Okay, so the very first time that you go in, they tell you your, diag your diagnosis is a contusion. A contusion is a bruise. They examine your wrist that day. Normal alignment, no acute fracture. You asked to do several MRIs, but they keep not finding anything. I see your pictures, and I see some swelling on your arm. I see definitely some cuts and stuff. They examine your wrist that day. Normal alignment, no acute fracture. You asked to do several MRIs, but they keep not finding anything. I see your pictures, and I see some swelling on your arm. I see definitely some cuts and stuff. They examine your wrist that day. Normal alignment, no acute fracture. You asked to do several MRIs, but they keep not finding anything. I see your pictures, and I see some swelling on your arm. I see definitely some cuts and stuff. So there are two parts to every piece of litigation like the one that you've brought. One is liability. Slam dunk for you. They admit it. The next is damages. I got to make sure that you're not making a bigger deal of this than it is. So there are two parts to every piece of litigation like the one that you've brought. One is liability. Slam dunk for you. They admit it. The next is damages. I got to make sure that you're not making a bigger deal of this than it is. So there are two parts to every piece of litigation like the one that you've brought. One is liability. Slam dunk for you. They admit it. The next is damages. I got to make sure that you're not making a bigger deal of this than it is. So I have to determine that you have a real problem, not you just keep going to the doctor and they keep finding nothing. That, you know, I mean, clearly you had some swelling. Clearly you had some cuts. You know, that's worth something. So I have to determine that you have a real problem, not you just keep going to the doctor and they keep finding nothing. That, you know, I mean, clearly you had some swelling. Clearly you had some cuts. You know, that's worth something. So I have to determine that you have a real problem, not you just keep going to the doctor and they keep finding nothing. That, you know, I mean, clearly you had some swelling. Clearly you had some cuts. You know, that's worth something. You're asking for the statutory maximum of five grand. You filed against the homeowners. What ended up happening with that? They didn't have coverage for their dogs. Is that accurate? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. You're asking for the statutory maximum of five grand. You filed against the homeowners. What ended up happening with that? They didn't have coverage for their dogs. Is that accurate? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. You're asking for the statutory maximum of five grand. You filed against the homeowners. What ended up happening with that? They didn't have coverage for their dogs. Is that accurate? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Your Honor. Yeah. Okay. So about one year to the date, we uh, got some letters from this uh, law group. You know, threatening letters. Hey, we want fifty thousand dollars in damages. Fifty thousand. Fifty thousand. Wow. Your Honor. Yeah. Okay. So about one year to the date, we uh, got some letters from this uh, law group. You know, threatening letters. Hey, we want fifty thousand dollars in damages. Fifty thousand. Fifty thousand. Wow. Your Honor. Yeah. So about one year to the date, we uh, got some letters from this uh, law group. You know, threatening letters, hey, we want $50,000 in damages. 50000 50000 Wow. And uh, we got uh, a couple threatening letters three times from them. Hey, pay us now or we're going to take you to court for it. Yeah. Um, they call lawyer letters. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I, mean, I guess it's upsetting. It, it's, yeah. it's intimidating because sure, we've sure. never been in this situation before. And uh, we got uh, a couple threatening letters three times from them. Hey, pay us now or we're going to take you to court for it. Yeah, um, they call lawyer letters. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I, mean, I guess it's upsetting. It, it's, you, yeah. it's intimidating because sure, we've sure. never been in this situation before. And uh, we got uh, a couple threatening letters three times from them. Hey, pay us now or we're going to take you to court for it. Yeah, um, they call lawyer letters. Yeah. yeah. It, I mean, I, mean I guess it's upsetting. It, it's, you, yeah. it's intimidating because sure, we've sure. never been in this situation before. But the, the insurance company finally sent, they sent a letter, they contact, they sent a letter back to the, the law group and said, you know, there's no, nothing here for you. Right, much. I know, and but then, that doesn't mean that dropped. she can't sue you. She can still sue oh, yeah, you. For sure. See, here's the deal, guys. You're supposed to keep your dogs inside. But the, the insurance company finally sent, they sent a letter, they contact, they sent a letter back to the, the law group and said, you know, there's no, nothing here for you. Right, much. I know, and but then, that doesn't mean that dropped. she can't sue you. She can still oh, sue yeah, you. For sure. See, here's the deal, guys. You're supposed to keep your dogs inside. But the, the insurance company finally sent, they sent a letter, they contact, they sent a letter back to the, the law group and said, you know, there's no, nothing here for you. Right, much. I know, and but then, that doesn't mean that dropped. she can't sue you. She can still oh, sue yeah, you. For sure. See, here's the deal, guys. You're supposed to keep your dogs inside. And yep. if you have eight-year-olds who leave the door <clears> open, <throat> as eight-year-olds are prone to do, then you should have a fence. And if you don't have a fence, then you get dragged into court if your dogs knock a lady over 
and or just bark and she falls. Either way, yeah. it's yeah. your fault. And yeah. if you have eight-year-olds who leave the door <clears throat> open, as eight-year-olds are prone to do, then you should have a fence. And if you don't have a fence, then you get dragged into court if your dogs knock a lady over and or just bark and she falls. Either way, yeah. it's yep. your fault. And yep. if you have eight-year-olds who leave the door <clears throat> open, as eight-year-olds are prone to do, then you should have a fence. And if you don't have a fence, then you get dragged into court if your dogs knock a lady over and or just bark and she falls. Either way, yeah. it's yep. your fault. Now, I agree. I need to make sure that this isn't just, you know, um, smoke and mirrors. Now, I agree. I need to make sure that this isn't just, you know, um, smoke and mirrors. Now, I agree. I need to make sure that this isn't just, you know, um, smoke and mirrors. May I ask you if what you wanted was to get your medicals covered, how come you never submitted a bill to them before uh, a lawyer asked them for 50 grand? May I ask you if what you wanted was to get your medicals covered, how come you never submitted a bill to them before uh, a lawyer asked them for 50 grand? May I ask you if what you wanted was to get your medicals covered, how come you never submitted a bill to them before uh, a lawyer asked them for 50 grand? Because when I tried to talk to Joanna the day she came over, she would not listen. She got very defensive, and I said, well, I'll just let animal control handle it. Because, I, because when I tried to talk to Joanna the day she came over, she would not listen. She got very defensive, and I said, well, I'll just let animal control handle it. Because, because when I tried to talk to Joanna the day she came over, she would not listen. She got very defensive. And I said, well, I'll just let animal control handle it. Because I didn't what want- What ended up happening with animal control? Uh, they cited us for off the leash and- Vicious um, animal. Vicious animal for one of our dogs, even though it wasn't- Did you have yet. to pay a fine? Yes, ma'am. How much? It was right at eighteen hundred dollars. Yeah, I didn't. What want... ended up happening with animal control? Uh, they cited us for off the leash and um, vicious animal. Vicious animal for one of our dogs, even though it wasn't. Did you have yet. to pay a fine? Yes, ma'am. How much? It was right at eighteen hundred dollars. Yeah, I didn't. What want... ended up happening with animal control? Uh, they cited us for off the leash and um, vicious animal. Vicious animal for one of our dogs, even though it wasn't. Did you have yet. to pay a fine? Yes, ma'am. How much? It's right at eighteen hundred dollars. Eighteen hundred dollars? I'm pretty sure. Yes, ma'am. Wow, that's where are you from? Hillsborough County, Florida. Yes, go, go, it's Hillsborough. Pretty expensive. They're not playing. Yeah, they're not playing. No, nope. uh, they shouldn't play. All right, guys, I've heard enough. Um, eighteen hundred dollars? I'm pretty sure. Yes, ma'am. Wow, that's where are you from? Hillsborough County, Florida. Yes, go, ma'am. go, it's Hillsborough. Pretty expensive. They're not playing. Yeah, they're not playing. No, nope. uh, they shouldn't play. All right, guys, I've heard enough. Um, Eighteen hundred dollars? I'm pretty sure. Yes, ma'am. Wow, that's where are you from? Hillsborough County, Florida. Yes, go, go, it's Hillsborough. It's pretty expensive. They're not playing. Yeah, they're not playing. No, nope. uh, they shouldn't play. All right, guys, I've heard enough. Um, look, it's your fault mm -hmm. that this happened. It's your fault that you have a problem with the neighbor. It's your fault that you uh, felt the need to put your house you loved for sale. Look, it's your fault. Mm -hmm that this happened. It's your fault that you have a problem with the neighbor. It's your fault that you uh, felt the need to put your house you loved for sale. Look, it's your fault mm -hmm. that this happened. It's your fault that you have a problem with the neighbor. It's your fault that you uh, felt the need to put your house you loved for sale. It's your fault that you had to move. It's your fault that, I mean, stuff happens. An eight-year-old can do what they do, but you understand what fault means. Mm -hmm. You may not have intended it. It still is your negligence or your household's negligence. It's your fault that you had to move. It's your fault that, I mean, stuff happens. An eight-year-old can do what they do, but you understand what fault means. Mm -hmm. You may not have intended it. It of still course. is your negligence or your household's negligence. It's your fault that you had to move. It's your fault that... I mean, stuff happens. An eight-year-old can do what they do, but you understand what fault means. Mm -hmm. You may not have intended it. It still is your negligence or your household's negligence. You know, mercifully, this is not a case where there was some vicious, you know, attack where somebody had 30 stitches. I get it, okay? And I also get that I am seeing a situation. You know, mercifully, this is not a case where there was some vicious, you know, attack where somebody had 30 stitches. I get it. Okay, and I also get that I am seeing a situation. You know, mercifully, this is not a case where there was some vicious, you know, attack where somebody had 30 stitches. I get it, okay? And I also get that I am seeing a situation where repeatedly, repeatedly, there 
are doctors, including not just the physicians at the emergency room, but your own doctor saying, we can't find evidence of what she's complaining about. Where repeatedly, repeatedly, there are doctors, including not just the physicians at the emergency room, but your own doctor saying, we can't find evidence of what she's complaining about. Where repeatedly, repeatedly, there are doctors, including not just the physicians at the emergency room, but your own doctor saying, we can't find evidence of what she's complaining about. Now, you said I still have swelling. Can you show me swelling? Can I come up? Yeah, can you come forward and just stand like a foot away from here? See this? Now, you said I still have swelling. Can you show me swelling? Can I come up? Yeah, can you come forward and just stand like a foot away from here? See this? Now, you said I still have swelling. Can you show me swelling? Can I come up? Yeah, can you come forward and just stand like a foot away from here? See this? Okay. I, I you know, I, mean, I, I don't know. Um, would it be normal for a person to have swelling two years later when they file a lawsuit? I don't know. That's how long it's been. That's why I had two MRIs. Right, <laughs> and then they can't find anything. Go ahead and go back. All right. I don't know. Um, would it be normal for a person to have swelling two years later when they file a lawsuit? I don't know. That's how long it's been. That's why I had two MRIs. Right, <laughs> and then they can't find anything. Go ahead and go back. All right. I don't know. Um, would it be normal for a person to have swelling two years later when they file a lawsuit? I don't know. That's how long it's been. That's why I had two MRIs. Right, <laughs> and then they can't find anything. Go ahead and go back. All right. I find that you folks are at fault, and I am awarding the defendant not 50000 not 5000 I am awarding her for her pain and suffering and scratches and bruises $1,000. That is my verdict. Good luck, folks. Thank, Thank you. you. I find that you folks are at fault, and I am awarding the defendant not 50000 not 5000 I am awarding her for her pain and suffering and scratches and bruises $1,000. That is my verdict. Good luck, folks. Thank, Thank you. you. I find that you folks are at fault, and I am awarding the defendant not 50000 not 5000 I am awarding her for her pain and suffering and scratches and bruises, $1,000. That is my verdict. Good luck, folks. Thank, Thank you. you.